Hello everyone, uh, this is the first video of this series. Uh, for this video we'll be doing a, a demo of the website that we're going to be building uh, using Django and another bunch of technologies. Uh, we're going to deploy the website on Heroku with a custom domain. The website is pretty simple. There is, uh, I would say this is for beginners uh, going into intermediate and we're going to use uh, this book guide that I wrote. Uh, it's been like two years since I wrote it but it's been updated to 2021 and yeah so we'll be going off this one you don't have to buy it it's on Amazon if you want to buy it but you don't have to the series is going to be free so I'll I'll just be going uh, off this book though so but I'll show you everything here so so don't worry about that so let's just do the demo for this application so the name of the application is bike finder uh, it lets us, uh, as you can see here, it says like find the latest bikes, parts, accessories. It's like an eBay for bikes. So let's just walk through this uh, website. So you can see the listings here. And you can search by condition, state, city. This can be changed, of course. Uh, you can see the listing. And you see more details about the listing. You can see the images uh, a little bit bigger. So you can register or you can log in if you already have an account. So let's just register a new account for now. Oh. All right, so we just register a new account. Okay, so now once you log, once you log in, you can see the, your username here on the top right corner. You can see the listings, of course. Uh, you go to my listings. So this is like a new link that appears once you log in. There's no listings here for now, so let's create a new listing. So this is just for testing purposes. Uh, so it's a bike, or it could be like a part or like a model. Or like uh you know another thing related to bikes you want to ship it or you want to just have it picked up or something like that so let's use the do that one condition used uh, city let's say uh, Los Angeles for new I'm not sure about the zip code let's just use that one so I know the price is I know it's more expensive than this but let's just stick to this one no So you can upload up to three photos. Um, we're gonna two of them are mandatory, but you can change this. Uh, this is just the settings that I have, I guess. So let's do this. Then this one. So now we're, we'll be creating the listing. So once you create the listing, you can see it here. So the image for this one didn't come out. All right, well, we can fix that, I guess. So now you have there are like two listings here, and you can see more details about the listings. I think this is because I downloaded the image uh, from a different source than this one. Okay. So you can see more uh, more details. If you wanna search by state, uh, you'll on, you will only see the the ones in that state. Same for the condition, if you used just that one, new, I think the other one is new, yeah. And then the same thing, and then you just type the city, this can be changed, as mentioned before. So if you go to my listings now, you will be able to see the product here. When you listed that product, you can view more details. Uh, we already did this. You can edit the listing. So let's say that you want to say, uh, I don't know, add the model, right? So 45, uh, edit listing, and then it changes, as you can see here. And also if you go here, it would change here. Uh, you can also delete the listing. It will tell you, do you wanna delete it? 
if you don't want to delete it you'll just go back if you want to delete it then you just uh, click here and then the listing is gone you go to the main page it's gone as well so this is the the website that we're going to be building uh, if this is something that you're interested in just stick around again we're going to be using Django to build this website and other technologies as well along the way uh, AWS for the images uh, we will be using um, S3 buckets uh, the, the uh, Postgre for the database uh, Postgres PostgreSQL database uh, yeah we'll be using a bunch of technology so if this is something that you like we'll go from beginning to end uh, this tutorial is meant for beginners to intermediate level and yeah stick around subscribe and see you uh, on the next video